Harry and Meghan's open letter to pharma bosses to Albert Burla, CEO Pfizer, Stefan Bansell, CEO Moderna, Pascal Soriot, CEO AstraZeneca, Alex Korsky, CEO Johnson & Johnson, Stanley Urk, CEO Novavax. The world owes you gratitude for leading the successful development and manufacturing of safe and effective vaccines against COVID-19. This was achieved in record time, amidst a once-in-a-century global pandemic. It's truly a testament to what can be achieved when partners work together towards a shared goal. However, the COVID-19 pandemic has exacerbated health, social, and economic inequality globally. The global vaccine rollout thus far further deepens these disparities with the poorest and most marginalized populations most adversely impacted. As of May 1, over 80% of the 1.2 billion vaccine doses administered globally have occurred in high- and upper-middle-income countries while the very lowest-income countries have administered just 0.4%. As we are seeing in countries like India, the urgency to deliver doses now to save lives and stop the spread of COVID-19 is only increasing. That's why it is imperative that we ensure equitable vaccine access global so that people are protected, economies can recover, and this global pandemic can be brought to an end everywhere. Therefore we, the undersigned, stand with global citizens who want to see COVID-19 vaccine manufacturers act with extraordinary purpose, responsibility and leadership in response to this equity crisis, including through the following actions. Moderna, we are pleased to see Moderna finally join the global vaccine initiative, COVAX, but the world's poorest countries cannot wait until the end of the year to access your life-saving vaccine. We therefore call on you to move up your delivery schedule with COVAX and increase the promised 2021 volume to at least 100 million doses. Pfizer, to date, Pfizer. BioNTech have only promised 40 million doses to COVAX, the fewest among vaccine producers. We call on you to commit at least 100 million additional doses to COVAX at a not-for-profit price and to deliver them as soon as possible this year. All, every possible measure to increase global supply must be on the table, including the temporary suspension of intellectual property and extraordinary global public-private collaboration resulting in wider transfer of technology and know-how. We call on each of you to end your opposition to these measures and work collaboratively with the global community to achieve universal access. If we work together in the global public interest, we will save lives at risk and we will defeat this deadly pandemic. Thank you for your consideration of this request.